Hey guys, in continuing my spades card game playing strategy series, today we're going to be talking about play of the hand. Now the first video was about bidding, and check out that video. I'm using the same exact hand here for consistency, and as mentioned in the first video, I'm bidding five tricks because we've got four trumps or four spades. Spades is always trump and spades, and with a uh, three or higher value is what you want to bid on. So if we had a two, we wouldn't count that. A king, so that's five. And then I've got a couple uh, stop cards here that prevent me from bidding higher. For example, you notice I don't have the queen of hearts, um, nor do I have the jack of diamonds. If I had the jack of diamonds, I would be queen, jack, ten, nine. That'd be pretty good. And I would I would definitely bet, bid another trick in that case. However, I don't, so I'm going to play it conservatively here. Now, as far as strategy goes, notice that we've got only two of the club suit and also of hearts. And we've got higher values in the hearts and lower here in the club. So let's say, for the sake of example, that I'm leading the trick. I'm to the players left at the table. And... You know, we, we can, can't lead with um, trumps until they're broken. So I'm going to be tempted to look at this pair right here and exhaust these. Because if I get these off the table um, and somebody plays clubs, which is pretty obvious that they're going to, uh, people have got more clubs certainly than I do, I could potentially win a trick uh, by what's called roughing the trick with a low trump, like that three. So I want to exhaust these. Now I could exhaust the hearts at first, but they're a higher value, and I have a very good chance of winning that um, king of hearts. I might even win a trick with the jack of hearts. So I'm looking at these. I know I'm going to lose this trick, and I'm going to get rid of this. Um, I would play that first. Now also... A convention is also used in bridge, for example, is if you play a low card, it's telling your partner that you're not really deep in that suit. So if I play the 10, you know, that's a little bit more, it could go either way. It could, it could indicate that I actually have a face card in clubs, but if I'm playing this three, um, an, an advantage of that shows my partner that I really, I'm not deep in clubs. Hey guys, thanks for watching. Did you enjoy this helpful spades tip? Post your comments below if you've got some other good gameplay strategies. And thanks for watching.